All right, guys, what's up? We're going to try a lake today that I've never fished before. We're going to Lake Arlington. I was told it was a good lake for bass right now. Uh, it's going to be a better day. It's only the highs only 92, and we got a bunch of rain coming in. So I guess we'll see how we'll do. Uh, I was told that this lake damn near is like two to three feet almost in the middle of it. And the deepest it'll get is... 12 to 15 feet, so yeah, I'm gonna try. Let's give it a shot. All right, so we made it out here. It is 86 degrees. Um, I don't know what the water temp is. I haven't even looked. It's probably in the 90s. We are going to start off fishing shallow today. There's a front moving in, so hopefully, hopefully they're going to be feeding before this rain comes. So we got it. So I was just cruising along. Like I said, I don't always know this lake. I'm pretty much almost, I mean, I'm, you would think I'm way, way, way far away from running into one foot of water. Cruising along, yeah, I just drilled one foot of water, killed the engine. But by doing that, it put me on a spot that's foot to two foot in the center of the lake, maybe I can catch something. There we go. You know, I found something. I told you we were holding a pocket of fish here. baby one. Healthy though. There's the reaction bite I was looking for right there. Color down. That's pretty ideal. And I just busted my shield. It's kind of funny. That just happened. Uh, All I did was hit it with a lipless crank and the thing broke. Look at this. Look, look at this. Literally just did this. Alright, so I went from this is a traditional shad color to I guess you want to call it KVD sexy shad. Let's give this a shot for about five minutes or so in the same pocket. They're still jumping. Hitting. I just don't know. Deal is. It's actually probably one of the best days we've had for fishing in weeks. It's been a hundred and 
100 degrees or more the last two weeks. Today's high is going to be 92. With the rain moving in here very shortly. There we go. Once again, another baby bass. You got a little green right there. I'm rubbing up against it. Color's good though. I'm trying to catch the ones that are feeding on that one. Alright. I don't know what to do right now. Caught two in one pocket. Two guys that are out here fishing on this lake that I've seen so far, I haven't seen them produce anything, so I guess I'm just being lucky. Just right over here, I, I keep finding it, but it's just I'm grabbing some fish, eating, feeding, but I went back to a lure that I caught a couple of this morning with to see if maybe we can produce another one out of here. Got one. Yeah, we got one. There we go. Little baby one, but at least you know we can get and put on some fish. Little baby bass. There's another one. Look at this little guy. Fish here, though, are, are healthy. I will say that. Look, look at this. Oh, ah. healthy. It's not bad. Look how small he is. Little small guy. Alright, so I just saw a good size one jump over here. I just lost the lure that has been catching all the fish today. It's stuck on somebody's roof. Yeah, it's uh, right above me. So, oh well. Let's try this one. All right, so today was not nearly as good as I thought it was going to be. Um, water temp's still really high. I mean, we're in the middle of summer, so it's going to be kind of difficult to get on fish. The lake's not, that lake wasn't deep at all, so they're going to be not moving too much. But whatever, had to try it out. So I'll have a whole bunch more videos coming here soon. This had to be my first one. Uh, I'll probably do two or three a week. So... Till then, I'll see you guys next time.